Morning everybody, back here again at the charger. Uh, just grabbing a bit of a charge. Uh, give you a little bit of a cold weather update this morning. Um, first of all, I'm gonna go and grab a coffee. So I'll catch you in a bit. So here we are again, another full Ionix charger. And this morning there's a little Robin knocking about. There he is. Um, so yeah, it's two degree, well, one degree now. It's gone, uh, gone down a little bit. It's been cold again last night, uh, down to minus four, I think it was where I was. Uh, so charging speeds dropped quite a bit, but I've been knocking about in it this morning, so it's not too bad. I was here the other day and it was down to 30. So, does the cold weather change your charging and your consumption? So as you can see, uh, it's not too bad. I mean, there's a couple of long journeys there um, to work. So 3.1 and 2.5, that, that wasn't too bad to be honest, considering. I was quite happy with that. Um, yes, the range just dropped down a little bit, but then as it gets warmer, you just don't see the miles dropping down as quick as, as it does that you would expect it to. So it's, it's, it doesn't appear to be that bad. So I'm also 10,430 miles in now. So I've had this car for nearly 12 months. So I'm kind of nearly, well, just over my 10,000 what I expected, but quite a few road trips and a few uh, bit of been about. Um, but yeah, it's been pretty impressive. Uh, has it caused any major problems with it being cold? Not really. It's been quite good to be fair. Um, you just got to, this morning I pre-warmed it, uh, defrosted it. Let's the video up there. Um, and that seemed to warm it okay. And then I got in it, I was here and there a little bit. And then I've come here to put some charge into it. Because what I don't want to happen is get that 12 volt thing. And I think from some of the comments and some of the other videos, there seems to be when the 20, when you get below 20% and then leave it, you then start to see the 12 volt battery getting affected. And I left it for a weekend, 16% um, and came back and it was completely dead. And a few other people had said the same thing. So it's interesting to see if that's the actual cause of it. Um, but yeah, has the car been good? Yeah, it has it's been really good. I've been really impressed with it. Needs a flipping good clean though, to be honest. Um, but are you gonna be disappointed when you get it? No. Do you be worried about the cold? Not really. Um, it's kind of, I, I, I kind of akin it to driving a bit too fast in the summer. So you just got to temper your speed anyway, that's not a problem. Um, and just be just be careful. Just and think about it. If you get on a long journey, there's plenty of places to charge. Yeah, they're getting busier. But I noticed something today on this. So I'd set the Ionities where I am at the minute um, as a favorite. And as I got close to it, it popped up with a little message saying there was how many stalls are all free and available, um, which I've never, never seen before. I thought it was really clever. That was just as I was approaching, so that was quite good. Because sometimes you get here and it's, it's hit and miss, really, as to whether or not you can get a spot, but they're not too bad. Right, so I've not seen any more than 57 kilowatts now, to be honest. 42%, uh, I've only been here for about 15 minutes. Uh, I don't need really any more for this weekend, and there's a, there's a bit of a cube forming, so I'm going to unplug and get off, and I'll... Uh... So guys, back here again, different day. After all that minus nine cold weather we saw, now got to 14 degrees. And as you can see, the temperatures have increased and so is the speed. Um, just touching just under 100 kilowatt hours just to get a bit of charge before the next couple of days. Just shows how much the temperature can change things. But I'll add this to the rest of the video and a few more things I'm gonna be doing in, uh, in the next couple of days as well. Take care. Uh, now here we are with summer speeds, 125 kilowatts, 14 degrees a few days before Christmas, that's not bad at all. <laughs> 